Let's make the chicken salad of all chicken salads. It's got a pomegranate lemon dressing on the salad with a cashew and onion duka. The chicken has been roasted in the oven. There are onions in there. There is even croutons, which taste like a chicken stuffing. Hang with me. Let me show you how to make it. It's the ideal summer dish. Hell no, it's the ideal any day chicken dish. Okay, let's crack into it. First thing we need to do is take the wings off, but let's have a look at our chicken. It's a butterfly chicken, you see? Like that. Pretty much every supermarket or good butcher has them. Let's get the outer part of the wing off. Now what we need to do is get the salt under the skin. We get our finger in under here and create a bit of space between the skin because if we season the skin it has a tough time penetrating it. And over the side. Leave our wings on here and position the chicken on there. It's going into the fridge and this is going to help us get a crispy skin. It's going to hang out in the fridge for 24 hours. Into the fridge for 24 hours and this is the magic that is going to get us a crispy skin. So I'll see you in 24 hours. So after 24 hours you can see the skin has started to dry out and that's going to help get us a crispy skin. Now we'll lift the chicken up, give it a sprinkling of salt. In goes all our sourdough bread, gluten free of course. Pop the chicken on top, into the oven. And because I've got a De Dietrich, I don't even need to preheat it. If you don't have a De Dietrich oven, then you need to set your oven onto 220 degrees Celsius and you're gonna cook it for about an hour. All I have to do is add in the weight, which is 1.3 kilos and I push play, it says it's going to be about 59 minutes or bang on an hour. Whilst our chicken's working at its magic in the De Dietrich oven or whatever oven you're using, let's get our salad ingredients ready. What you'll need is some Italian leaf parsley torn, some basil, tomatoes cut up, some red bell pepper cut up, red onion or brown or white, whatever takes your fancy, thinly sliced, your favourite mustard, I'm using hot whiskey mustard. A cashew and onion duca, just a duca will do fine, but this is spectacular. Pomegranate balsamic and a lemon extra virgin olive oil. And then a bunch of lettuce, I'm using cos lettuce, you pick what you like. At 200 degrees until they're crispy, this is going to rest for 15 minutes. And the De Dietrich at 200 degrees will do just fine, that's about a teaspoon, one, two, and three of the pomegranate balsamo. But hey, if you like recipes, visit goldsdeli.co.nz. Now we start whisking this up. You just keep going and it will emulsify. To start off with, it doesn't look like it will, but any minute it looks like a beautiful creamy dressing and you've got a delicious sauce, but look at that, it's creamy and delicious. We're gonna get the red bell peppers in there, the red onion that's sliced up, the Italian leaf parsley in there, the tomatoes in there. That's what we like here now, let's get the salad in here. And I'm gonna get my hands dirty now. I'm going to get it really mixed in well. If you've washed your lettuce, really make sure that you dry it well. Oh, look at that. It's just a beautiful salad on its own, isn't it? Next, we're going to put half of the duca on, which is about one tablespoon. This is kind of like your chicken stuffing. They've soaked all the juice up, they're crispy, and it's gluten-free sourdough. Cook 
croutons over the top. Now I'll do get another tablespoon over the top. This is the unexpected over the top. There you have it folks, you've seen how to make a pomegranate salad, you could serve it on, how to get crispy skin on your chicken, croutons that are gluten free that have soaked up all that goodness, and it looks delicious on a plate, doesn't it? And now of course, if you want one of those Dedectric ovens, because of that roast chicken feature, it doesn't get easier than that. See you next time.